Hi there, I'm Chris May, host of This Day in Weather History, a podcast from the Weather Network. They called it the Saskatchewan Blizzard of 2007. It is said to be the worst winter storm in Saskatchewan history. And if you know Saskatchewan's history with winter storms, that's saying a lot. That's really super high praise. It was a winter storm that struck uh, northeastern BC and then continued on a line through central Alberta, then central Saskatchewan on January 10th of 2007, this day in weather history. Saskatoon alone saw 36 centimeters of snow on the 10th. Then that front swept past. The temperatures dropped and a strong wind picked up. The wind chills were a horrifying minus 46. It set up for one of the worst winter scenarios, as I'd mentioned, that anyone had seen in, in recent history. So that wind picked up that cold, fluffy snow, whiteout conditions, closed the highways in and around uh, Saskatoon and the, and, and the vicinity. Um, the blizzard conditions out at the airport closed down the the Prince Albert Airport, the Saskatoon Airport. Now you had travelers and locals stranded with no highways and no airports. Nobody's going anywhere. Hotels did their best to try and put as many people up as they could, but there just simply weren't enough uh, for for the gravity of this situation. People had to stay overnight in 24-hour retail operations. There were people that were staying overnight in the local Costco. It shut down many public services as well, as you can imagine. However, the unionized uh, snowplow operators who were on strike at the time agreed to get back in their trucks in the interest of public safety to try and get the streets cleared. It was an absolute mess. The Saskatchewan blizzard of 2007, this day in weather history.